This gives you a little idea of how much the water has gone down around the lake. I think it's gone down at least a foot. We'll do some calculations. But uh, look how high the docks are off the water. And uh, there's beaches where there normally aren't beaches. So the lakes are down. So the water levels have really gone down over the last couple, three months. Here's an interesting chart. Thought you might enjoy actually kind of a broaden out. West Lake right now is about six and a half inches below the outlet below lower gar. Look what it's done over the last 12 months. It was hanging right in there about, you know, about just on the edge there. And then over in the middle of the summer, like in June and July, we had quite a bit of rain. Look, it went way up. In other words, it was rolling over. And look what's happened since, oh, the middle of August. We've been dry. Boom! It's gone from a little above running over to weight six and a half inches below. So in other words, we've lost well over a foot, probably a foot and a half in the peak of the summer to where we are now, which is really amazing. Now on Big Spirit, it's some, it's, it's almost completely different. On Big Spirit, we were really low all the way through the summer. Remember, we were like 24 inches below the spillway. It was really, really low. And then we got all that rain again in the summer, got up, never really got above, the, I think for like one day it ran over the spillway. But, uh, and now it's come back, but it hasn't gone back quite as fast as Westlake. So right now we are still about 12 and a half inches below the spillway on Big Spirit Lake. So I'm telling you, we are really dry around here. Uh, we're, we, we really need some rain. So uh, just thought you might like to see a little update on how things are going with the lake levels and all that. We'll keep you posted. Take care, be safe, and we'll talk to you soon.